E, well, hello guys. It's Murray Mint. We've got the Dirks. We're here to give you a lesson, not in life, in Geordie. Now, the reason for this is because I'm a celebrity is coming back on. Now, I'm not by any means saying I am a typical Geordie, as much as, you know, you probably think I am. Football mad, uh, tune, 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 lads, lads, lads. Ooh, no, I'm not. I'm not any of that. But I do work in Newcastle and I do live in the area. I qualify to let you at least explain some of the words. For people who don't know any Geordie, I think this will really help. So, shall we get started then? The first thing I think is really important for people to know is... I'm gonna do the tune, I'm gonna get proper mortal. That's a phrase that is used quite a lot in the tune. It means I'm gonna go to the town and have a drink. So if you repeat after me, I'm gonna go to the tune and get proper mortal. The next one, very important if you're a smoker. Yeah, can I lend a snout? Or, yeah. Can I lend a tab? Or, yeah, can I have after you on that tab, please? Could I please have a cigarette? And the last one, could I share a cigarette with you? Yeah, can I have after you on that snout, please? So that means, can I share the cigarette with you? I know I sound like I smoke, but I actually don't. Visit in Newcastle, or oh yeah, and you hear, and you hear someone saying this. I am in a proper fit on my leg. It means I'm really, really angry. So, can you repeat? I'm in a proper fit on my leg. A right Bobby Dazzler. So how you would say that? Oh yeah, he's a right Bobby Dazzler on him leg. It means he looks good. Really, really made an effort. Oh, he's a right Bobby Dazzler, isn't he? Annoying. If you're getting on someone's nerves, you would say, oh yeah. He's a proper worky ticket him leg. Repeat after me. Oh, yeah. He's a proper worky ticket him leg. Oh, gizzardeek, gizzardeek. Can I have a look? Oh, gizzardeek. Here. Divin be nebby. Divin be nebby. That's what people would do. It means mind your fucking business. I mean, you know, it's probably not as strong, but it's it's definitely a warning. Definitely a warning to stay back. Yeah, didn't you be nebby? The less you know, the less the coppers know. Oh, where's me scran? I'm clubbing me. Where is my lunch? I'm very hungry. Hmm. Ninety-five percent of Geordies love tea. So this one is calm, dude. I'll make you a cup of tea. Just calm down. I'll make you a cup of tea. Calm down. I'll make you a cup of This one is, you don't ever want to be faced with this sort of person. I'm the opposite, the polar opposite of this person. Raggy. Raggy. I'll say it in a, in a sentence. Hey, I'm on your after Raggy. It means you're off. Your lips, you like. Oh, you little raggy. So yeah, you don't want to be called a raggy. And you don't want to be face to face with a raggy. Either way, you're fucked. I'm Ganyem, and it just means I'm going home. Plain and simple, going home. Had a way, man. So I'll say it in a sentence. Oh, had a way, man. It means no. I don't think so. Why I man? Why I man? Why I man means, of course, no bother. Sorry, I was a bit choked. Of course, no bother. So, why I man? Canny. Not to be mistaken with canny. Canny. Proper canny him leg. It means nice. Eyes oh, proper canny him leg. Hey, that was kind of good, that. So it means like, yeah, it was, it was good. Yeah, yeah. Really pleasant. So the last one. How are you, man? How are you, man? How are you, man? 
Oh, Hawaii man. Hawaii man? See? Three different ways of saying the same phrase. And it just means, come on. There's lots of other words like shan, toon, doon, cloon, off your dish, off your lips. That was just a brief outline of some Geordie that might help you with I'm a Celebrity because it's coming in two weeks. Now feel free to write in the comments anything that you feel that I've missed. Toon Toon Black Man Army!